the matter of space-time. First of all, we must understand that we are perceiving a vision. It is divided and scattered in the space-time because we cannot perceive the wool. This wool is represented as a, the 10 cycle of 10 units existing ordered in way progressive in a line. This 10 cycle is the ideal cycle of all the units because it is the general cycle of what is named space-time which exists in four dimensions, three of space and one of time. In fact, three divided by three plus its inverse made by three multiplied by three gets one plus nine equal ten, like a wave, massed and expanded, where one is a flow's line of a mass and 9 is the surface in which everything is stopped in the time, being a surface only of space. Consequently, the 10 cycle is the synthesis of every other numerical cycle, amassed and expanded. In fact, 1 has the cycle amassed expanded made by 1 divided by 1, plus 1 multiplied by 1, that is uh, equal to 2. 2 has uh, the cycle amassed expanded by 2 divided by 2, plus 2 multiplied by 2, and equal to 5. 3 has the cycle amassed expanded made by 3 divided by 3, plus 3 multiplied by 3 and equal to 10. And we see that uh, is uh, the combination of the cycle of the unity and uh, of the cycle of the binary existence in the two positive and negative directions existing in every geometrical line. 10 is also 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4. That is the full summation which Considering the base 10 of every number is 10 raised to 4, factorial. It is the foundation of the God 1 and 3 of the Jesus Christ. 4 has the cycle of mass expanded made by 4 divided by 4 plus 4 multiplied by 4 and equal to 17 which represents 10, the whole cycle, plus 7, the entire creative activity of God, the biblical week of six days of work and one of not work. 5 has the cycle of mass expanded made by 5 divided by 5, plus 5 multiplied by 5, and equal to 26. And it is the cycle of that foundation that is named 1 of the time and the 3 of the space, a matter that understood in that foundation of the faith that is named God brings to the Jesus God 1 and 3 whose cycle is uh, the 26 that the Jew Kabbalah attributes to the name uh, Yahweh and uh, the same uh, 26 that uh, the Italian Kabbalah attributes to the word Dio 4 plus 9 plus 15 which gets 26 in the three letters because of the position in the Italian alphabet. 6 has uh, the cycle amassed expanded made by 6 divided by 6 plus 6 multiplied by 6 and equal to 37. It represents the trinity of uh, the 10 cycle plus the entire creative activity 
of God, seven days. The circle of the number seven, which represents the entire activity of the absolute foundation that we can naming uh, Almighty God, is uh, seven divided by seven plus seven multiplied by seven and equal to fifty. In this way, the cycle of the number two, equal to five, is the tenth of the cycle of the number seven, and is the complex unity of the half part, the real one, of ten multiplied by ten, equal to one hundred. In this way, one hundred is the absolute surface that has the ten circles as its own side. Because of our reality, which is always the half part of the wool, and which is named the real one, and that is always referred to the opposite one, which is named the imaginary one, this our analysis of the different numerical cycles confirms what the faith of the Jews has affirmed by revelation that it was said, it was made by God. Seven is the full cycle of the days and we can divide a terrestrial year in all its weeks. They are 52, with one day remaining, and these numbers represent 7 multiplied by 7 equal to 49 as the full surface, plus the entire three dimensions in line of the following volume, three direction of the space that are corresponding to the same trinity of the foundation of everything, which or who is named God, while the one day remaining in the full years of 52 weeks represents the moving unity in the time as the unity in itself. One plus seven times 52 is equal to 1 plus 364 and equal to 365. Naturally, also 365 days must be coherent and it is the 10 cycles of the 4 cycle that is 37. 10 times 57 is 370, where 365 is made by 370 reduced by the half imaginary part 5 of the 10 cycle. But in a more ordered counting, we must start from 10 cycles of 4 multiplied by 4 so from 360 and we have to add 7 days in X, 7 days in Y and 7 days in Z. So 7 plus 7 plus 7 equal to 21 days that are the entire contribution of Father, Son and Holy Spirit like the three axes X, Y, Z. But since the real time is moving in one only direction of the four made by X, Y, Z, T, or of the unity and the trinity of God, the general 21 days of the trinitary contribution must be divided by four. So, 21 days divided by 4 exactly get 5.25, equal 
to five days plus one quarter of day. Therefore, 360 plus 5.25 gets the result of the exact 365 days and one quarter of day in which the astronomic year is truly divided. Now, the problem is this. Why this ideal conformation of a year in 365.25 days is really one year? Is rotating the Earth in a universe which is truly ordered by the 10th cycle? Or the 365.25 days of the astronomic complete rotation are a simple case that depends only on our fortune? Or is it true? that the space is the same time, one order as n, and the other order as n rise to minus one, or one divided by n, one as an integer in units, and the other as a part, a decimal part of it, is 10 divided by one as the unitary space, and is 1 divided 10 like the unitary time? Is 10.1 the space time in its unit? In fact, 10 divided by 10 plus 10 multiplied by 10 is 101. And it is the 10th cycle of 10.1. In this way, the universe made by a immense space has to be ordered by the 10th cycle. But in what a way? If 10 is the absolute quantity in line, all the absolute volume is 10 units in three lines, exception or father, son, and holy spirit. So it is 10 raised to 3 in its space, and 10 in its time. It is, in this way, 10 raised to 4 in all its real part. But there is another 10 raised to 4 in the corresponding imaginary part, while 10 raised to 2 is the absolute surface. 10 raised to 8 is the absolute in length, and 10 raised to 2 is its absolute transversal geometrical plane. In other words, the absolute is 10 raised to 10 in one only line of the time. If we start from the atomic unit of our structure, 10 raised to 10 atomic units of the atomic space have to be the unit of the universe, its exact matter, and it is. But uh, we have not obtained the matter by proceeding from the particular to the general. On the contrary, we have acted in the inverse way by proceeding from our entire world, our planet, the Earth, considered 10 raised to 7 in one quarter of its meridian, where 7 is the full movement of 3 in the 10th cycle, and 10 raised to 7 is its absolute quantity that we can assign to the absolute part that for us is our planet, our world. In the 
precise moment that four times t and x, y, z or God one and three were multiplied by the absolute ten raised to seven, in that precise moment we considered the meridian as the Earth's cycle one and three, and its inverse part was the perfect unit, the exact matter to be able to measure everything. Only when we started from 10 raised to 10, divided by 10 cubed, all the unitary mass, we add 10 raised to 7, as all its possibility to be moved in the absolute of 10 raised to 10. And it is absolute 1, not in consequence of a choose that could be made also adopting a different number. In fact, every number has its own cycle, and only that of number 10 is representative of all the other. We have seen it. In other words, the number 10 exists really as the lord of our numerical system, and the time in its unit is the same 10 when it is risen in mathematical power of minus 1. Therefore, we can count the date and the time. When we have a quantity in a surface which exists only in power to exist, if we divide this absolute quantity by the unitary surface with side 1, we have all the real flow in single unitary quantities of years, months and days. The years is the unit, the months are the percent of the unit, and the days are the 10 rise to minus 4 part of the unit. I make the case of 100, that is the absolute quantity of 10 multiplied by 10, in the real flow of the only real part, great the middle of 10, 5. The combination of 10 and 5 is, in its absolute, 10 raised to 100 multiplied by 10 raised to 5, because of 100 and 5 are only exponents of the 10 cycle of everything, as one only God. The multiplication is the sum of the indices 105, so that 105 is the sum that represents the volume having the surface 100 and the real flow in the half real part of the 10 cycle. Since this 105 represents an absolute whole, we know that it is trinitary one in the direction x, y, z or in the Father, Son and the Holy Spirit. We, to have 105 only in one direction, know that 105 has to be divided by 3. It is so 55% the quantity in every component. In units, this 35% is 
0.35 units. The surface is made acting the score of 0.35 and we have 0.1225 that has to be valued as 0 unit in the year's unit. The month 12 and the percent and the day 25 in the 10 raised to minus 4 sides of the unit. Since this quantity is representative of the whole real, we can fix this date as that in which a lord is incarnated in our world built by this exact orders.